Case against Casey, Cindy Anthony is finishing a second day of testifying under oath in connection with her daughter's upcoming murder trial. Her deposition at the state attorney's office is not open to reporters, but her long hours of questioning underscore why she is a critical piece of the upcoming case. Now, West 2's Bob Keeling was there today, and Bob, Cindy is critical to both sides. Well, that's right, and the defense attorney we spoke with says that really Cindy is important to the state's case. They're asking so many questions because she could be critical to proving motive. But at the same time, he says he fully expects Jose Baez to point the finger at Cindy to explain why Casey's not guilty. Cindy, how did it, uh, Cindy Anthony shook her head and smiled and refused to talk about all of the questions prosecutors have been asking her behind closed doors. These days are the Anthony family. Jose Baez confirmed the Anthony family is being deposed this week. He says what he's heard so far is consistent with what he's been hearing. The state has to take depositions the same way the defense does, so it's really just part of the case. I think the, there is tension now between Cindy and Jose Baez. Defense attorney Richard Hornsby says he thinks Baez will use Cindy and her overbearing ways to defend Casey's actions in trial. I think he's going to. Um, I, I, she's a perfect person for it. She creates the villain character. I don't think a jury is going to warm to her. Hornsby says Cindy is just as crucial for the state to prove motive. So they have to ask her as much as they can now to pin her down in case she tries to change her story at trial to protect Casey. She's not going to be easy to push around, um, you know, or to easily extract information that you, the specific information you want. Now, Lee Anthony is scheduled to be deposed at 9 o'clock in the morning, and at the same time tomorrow morning, we're also expecting the state attorney's office to release 1,500 more pages of evidence, so it should be a busy day in the case tomorrow. Reporting from the newsroom, Bob Keeling, West Two News. Bob, thank you.